हेलो एवरी वन आई एम डॉक्टर संतोष पाटिल आई एम कंसल्टंट न्यूरोवैस्कुलर इंटरनेशनल रेडियोलॉजिस्ट वर्किंग एट मणिपाल हॉस्पिटल खराड़ी टूडे वी विल नो अबाउट ब्रेन स्ट्रोक सो वॉट इज ब्रेन स्ट्रोक सो वी ऑल नो अबाउट कार्डियक अटैक और हार्ट अटैक ब्रेन स्ट्रोक इज समथिंग सिमिलर वी कॉल इट एज ब्रेन अटैक वाई डज इट हैपन इट कैन हैपन बिकॉज ऑफ टू रीजन्स वन वी कॉल इट एज इस्किमिक स्ट्रोक वेर द ब्लड विसल सप्लाइंग द ब्रेन दे गेट ब्लॉक बिकॉज ऑफ फॉर्मेशन ऑफ क्लॉट इन साइड दे The other one is hemorrhagic stroke, where the blood vessels supplying the brain can burst open and form bleeding inside the brain. So, how do we come to know that a person is suffering from brain stroke? So, we have formed a, a, a very simple mnemonic, which is easy to remember. We call it as B fast. The, the the first letter in this mnemonic is B. That means if there is a loss of balance or a person is suffering from headache or dizziness. E E stands for eye. If there is loss of vision or the vision is you know impaired, the next letter is F. If the face is drooping to one side, the next letter is A. If you have weakness in the arms or the legs, if there is tingling sensation in the arms and legs, then the next letter is S, where there is you know impaired speech or you are finding it difficult to speak. So these are all the symptoms or signs of stroke. The next letter in the mnemonic is T, which stands for time. It signifies that time is very important in stroke. If you are suffering from all these signs, you have to reach to a stroke-ready hospital as early as possible. Remember, time is brain. So, each minute of stroke, about 20 lakh cells of brain they die, and we cannot recover them. So, it is very important that you reach to a stroke-ready hospital as early as possible. A stroke-ready hospital can provide you treatments such as IV thrombolysis and mechanical thrombectomy, wherein we can take out the blocks inside the blood vessels of the brain. So, these treatments are very modern treatments, are available in a very few institu institutions, and they can give you a good recovery from stroke. So, how can we prevent stroke? There are different you know ways how we can uh, modify our risk factors of stroke number 1 is you have to maintain your blood pressure and blood sugars you have to have a tight control of your blood sugars as well as blood pressure by having regular uh, medicines for these uh, uh, these ailments and you can have a proper follow up with your physician apart from that you have to follow a proper healthy lifestyle wherein you can do moderate exercises follow healthy life uh, healthy diet where you can have more intake of green leafy vegetables and fruits and avoid junk foods you also have to avoid smoking or any form of tobacco intake so all these things can help you greatly in reducing your risk of getting stroke thank you